What's going on everybody? I'll come here back to some MK11 and today I'm going to share a very important tip with Lotus Fist Kung Lao. This is brought up to me by a Jareth05. Jareth05 wants to know how do you whiff dive kick cancel to extend your combos? So I'm going to help you out my brother including some of you guys. So from medium distance and only medium distance you want to do your amplified spin so you can cancel into your uh, whiffed dive kick. All right. So I'm going to show you what happens if you do it from close range. If you do it from close range, all three hits will land and you will not recover in time to do the combo properly. And on a lot of occasions, the dive kick will land and you don't want the dive kick to land. You want it to whiff so you can extend your combos. So that is the reason why you want to do it from medium distance. All right. So I'm going to show you how fast Kung Lao uh, can recover. So I'm going to give you an example. So when you do it from medium distance, you only want to land the, the last two hits of the string, not all three. You want to land the last two hits of the string. And I'm going to even teabag right here. Watch this. I'm going to do the spin and I'm able to teabag. I'm able to uh, walk back and forth while my, while my opponent is in the air. So that is the secret to landing a dive kick cancel. Now that is where Lost Soul comes in. Lost Soul is the combo starter you want to uh, use his forward one three uh, reason being is because it leaves you at that sweet medium distance for you to amplify your spin to land the jump forward two to with your dive kick all right so it's going to take some getting used to it's going to take some muscle memory but once you get good at it you can do uh, fancy stuff like this something like this real quick You know, good way to end your match in a fancy way. So on a side note, when you whiff your dive kick, you want to slightly wait. All right. Look at Kung Lao's hand. When you do his dive kick, you're going to see you want to wait for him to reset to his neutral position. So that is the key to landing the combo. So when you do his uh, dive kick cancel, when you when you land, you want to slightly wait a second before you hit your 2-1 uh, into spin into whatever ender you want to do so that is how you dive kick cancel now here's an alternative for those of you struggling still with the dive kick cancel so when you jump one you can combo after but the the goal is when you uh jump one you want to slightly delay it because if you don't it'll whiff you you'll whiff his forward two one so that's an alternative so what you want to do is you want to do his his lost soul string slightly delay jump one and then when you land you do his forward to one spin into whatever ender you want so uh, that's the alternative and that is my tips and tricks uh, that i'm sharing with you guys hopefully uh, you found these tips helpful if you guys found the tips helpful consider leaving a like comment below tell me what you guys think uh, that's all i have for you guys my name is severe outcome and i'll catch y'all next time